Help! I'm locked in a room with my dentist. Hello, everybody! I'm Kindly Kid, and today we're playing a brand new 12 locks game. Apparently, we're throwing a party. That's cool. We gotta make sure that we have the disco truck. Yeah, absolutely. But Vlad, the lorry is locked with 12 locks. The, the lorry, I think that's what they call trucks in like Europe. How are we going to have fun now? You're right. How do you have fun without a disco truck? Don't worry, we'll soon open all these locks. Okay, so we have to free the disco truck. And this is the first level, so it's like giving us a tutorial to get started, I guess. And there's the green key. Thank you. Also, software update ready to install. What software? No one really knows. Okay, I, I know how to play the game. So now I have to find all the other locks. I see that there's a gear on the top of the truck. I'm gonna take it. We'll probably need that later. Is there anything else going on with the truck that... Uh, uh, there's this. What is going on with this? Oh. Do we need to crank up the volume on everything? Set it to 11? I don't know if this is actually what you're supposed to do. There might be like a an actual puzzle here. There's, there's probably some kind of indicator of like what level you're supposed to set every one of those rows. I haven't made it that far yet. What's going on with the, the disco light ball thing? Nothing, okay. There's a record. All right, maybe I'll use that later. What the heck is this? Do we, what is this thing? Oh, oh, do I put this here? Yes, okay, that, that did something. Did it do enough? That's the question. Maybe I need to close it. It did not do enough. Wait, maybe I close that and then... Maybe I gotta put something in there? Radio? What the heck? This thing is ancient technology. You need cassettes for this thing. Okay, so we'll need to find a cassette. A lightning bolt. Oh, oh. I don't know what that is. It looks kind of like a button or something, maybe. I'm sure we'll figure out what it's for at some point. There's another disc, and then we've got just like a straight up puzzle. Oh, okay, it's one of these sliding ones. All right, all right. Um, these always are difficult. Okay, this is this needs to go to the lower left. This one needs to go to the lower right. How am I gonna get you over there without moving the one that is already there? Okay. And then move you over there. And then move you over there. And get you out of here. Okay. Uh-huh. Yeah. That is where that is supposed to be. You need to get over here. You need to go down one. How many? Oh my gosh. I'm just making a bigger mess. There we go. Here we go. There we go. Okay. We're making progress. This one needs to go to the upper right. There we go. You gotta get to the upper left. Okay, okay, all right, we'll, we'll get there. And then get this guy back. And then, ooh, it's starting to come together. Okay, we're almost there. There's a problem here. <laughs> How am I gonna get this piece out? Okay, wait, 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 wait. No, that's not gonna work. That's not working. That, okay, that's working. That's definitely working. But I gotta, I gotta mess this all up now to get this piece. No, that, what am I doing? Messing everything up, man. Okay, s no. <laughs> Stop messing things up. They they were happy where they were. Bring this over here, and then bring this one down here. Bring that over there. I'm 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 working. I'm I'm working on this. Oh gosh, we're so close. We're so close. How am I gonna get that piece back? I gotta get these two swapped. I think we got it. I think we got it. We got it. <laughs> These puzzles, man. Especially those sliding ones. I don't know what it is about those, but they, they, they mess with my head. What's this kid doing? Oh, a cassette. He's just dancing on the disco stage, doing his thing. I see that there's a disc in disco, but I can't take it. Okay. Do I have to, ooh, maybe I match what's on the left side? Yes. Give me the star key. Oh, what? Right, right, right. It's DDR, dude. Down. Down. Left. Right. Up. Do a jumping jack. You got this. You got this, kid. You're killing it. You're going places. This is the greatest disco dance I've ever seen. 
There we go. Are you gonna give me a key for my amazing DDR skills? I used to be super into DDR. We had like those those terrible plastic mats that you could plug into like a PlayStation. Literally, I think it was like PlayStation 2, I think is, is what we played it on. They were awful because they would never stay like perfectly flat. I mean, imagine dancing on like on top of a sheet. It's going to get all wrinkled and weird. That's what the DDR pads would do, but but we were into it. Oh my gosh. 3648. What does that mean? I'm sure we'll find somewhere to put in a number. We've got another disco ball. Oh. I just blew up the disco ball and it gave me a disco key. Thank you. DJ's just chilling. Hee hee. Hee hee. What are you doing? Oh, you need Ah, you need the records. Oh, also, I can lift this. Why would I do that? I don't know. Give him the other disc. Boom. Are you good? Oh. What? Oopsie. Okay. Okay, you gotta press the, the, the middle? Oh. Oh, we're kind of playing like Simon Says. Okay, left, right. Oh, gosh. Okay, we go boom, boom, and then hit that button, and then that button. Okay, upper right, red disc, left, blue disc, bottom, upper right, red disc, blue disc. Oh, that hurts. I wasn't even looking at what he pressed. Did he press the middle? And then blue disc, and then red disc. Oh my gosh. This is so hard. Okay, pay attention. Red disc, or, yeah, yeah. And then lower right. Okay, upper right, red disc, left, blue disc, bottom. Upper right, red disc, left, blue disc, bottom. <laughs> Let's just say Simon Says is not my strongest skill. Also, you guys looking at this, this like the, the meter that's at the bottom of his DJ station kind of looks like that one puzzle we were looking at. But I don't, I don't think that's it. I, I thought maybe like there's a code in there, but that seems way too complicated. Hello, little girl. What are you doing? Sitting on top of that speaker. You're feeling the bass. What? What? Whoa. Plug this in. Can I plug it into the DJ station? Do I plug it back into itself? Where do I plug this thing in? Oh, I plug it into her headphones. Oh my gosh. You're, you're going to like explode if I do that. It's too much power. No, I can't. There's an invisible wall. I don't know. I don't know what to do with that. Let's let's use some of the locks that we already have, or the keys to unlock the locks. Boom. Boom. I don't know what this button is for. Oh, we also have this, the lightning bolt key. Okay. We have more hunting to do. Does this thing go in here? Oh, it does. Huh? We're making bubbles? It's a bubble machine. Does it need like another ingredient? Maybe? Maybe that's the problem. I don't, I don't know. It's making a lot of bubbles. Maybe I just let the bubbles kind of build up. Maybe eventually it'll spit out a key. It does not appear to be. Oh, there was a key in there. Okay, sweet. Add the cassette, hit play. Bump it. All right. So we got the bubble key. We got the blue key. There's still... Oh, 3648. Where do you think that goes? Is there a number pad? There is. 3648. Give it to me. I'm insane. Open the blue one. Open the bubble one. So we just have two keys. Red and purple. What's under your hat, kid? Nothing. All right. What's going on with speaker girl? What's your deal? Do I plug this in over here? She wants it. It's like she's reaching for it. Oh, oh, wait a second. Maybe I can. Oh, she's getting those beats blasted straight into her brain. And I think she's loving it. There's two more puzzles, right? Because we have to figure out this thing in the upper right. And then we need to find the red key. And I think the red key has something to do with this, maybe? Like, why can you do this? Why why can you move this? I don't understand. Oh, oh! 
There's the red key. Okay. So the only puzzle left is this. Do you think maybe like we can, we're, we're trying to listen? Like maybe as you adjust it, it, I don't know. I'm just guessing at this point and it's not working. Let's set them all to zero. This is pain. Okay, there's gotta be more to this. Like th this right here is, oh wait, two. They all stop at a certain level. The first one only goes to two. The second one always goes to four. I think we figured it out. I think we got it. This is two. This is four. Okay. Then the third row goes to three. The fourth row goes all the way. In fact, I think it's the only row that goes to the very top. Okay. Okay. So next row is three. No, 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 no. Don't mess that up. I don't know which knob does what. Okay. So you're three, and then you go all the way up, and I'm pretty sure you were here, and I think this one was, was three, the last one. Let's see. I feel pretty smart about that one. Okay, let's open the disco truck. The party is here. Finally, success. Yay, the lorry is open. Now we can have fun because no one was having fun. But now the time has come. Thank you for helping us open all these locks. You're welcome. Did that really only take me seven minutes and 45 seconds? Well, 44 seconds? No, I've been recording for 19 minutes. I still don't understand how they time these puzzles. Look at my level bonus. Holy cow, 100 coins, I'm rich. His baby tooth is loose. It hurts. We gotta take this kid to the dentist. We need to pull it out, oh my gosh. All right, so here I am trapped in a room with my dentist, trying to help him find the tools to torture me. This doesn't seem right. A dentist that lost all of his tools seems like a dentist that should not be a dentist. But here I am helping him find his tools to rip out my teeth. I hate this, but this is kind of cool because we're not actually looking for locks. We're looking for, for instruments of torture. <laughs> the dentist isn't that bad, but something about having my teeth scraped at and scratched at and wiggled and uh, it just sends chills down your spine. Uh. All right, what's going on with this thing? Oh, I hate these puzzles. I hate them. Help. Okay. I gotta rotate the, the two blues into position. One more. There you go. Okay. How am I gonna do this without messing up everything that I've got going? The problem is, is I gotta line these these oranges up. I can do this. I promise. But my brain, it hurts. Basically, I need to position the blue and the orange in the center circle in a way that allows me to just do one rotation to get the oranges into place. I know it's like a really complicated thought process and I'm probably overcomplicating it. Oh gosh, I accidentally left. Okay, it didn't reset the puzzle, thank you. So it needs to be there, but then I need to get the greens out. And then the problem is, is that I take an orange when I start rotating it, so I need to put an orange in place Oh my gosh, my brain. A few moments later. At this point, I'm just pressing buttons and hoping for the best. And, um, turns out not a great strategy for the record. One hour later. Okay. Is this not? I don't know what else I can do here. I feel like I got it. This is not correct. Three hours later. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I got it completely backwards. All right. Because look at the center. The, the one on the left is orange. The one on the right is blue. I completely, completely got it reversed. I am embarrassed. Wait, 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 wait. But if I have a good, like, I think I messed it up already. One eternity later. If I had played it right, I probably could have rotated everything perfectly into place. There it is.
That did not need to take as long as it did, but I'm glad we figured it out eventually. Still don't know what any of this stuff is. What's going on with this thing? Can I cut it? No, I can adjust the, the height of the star. A screwdriver. Oh, you gave me three, two, seven, five, one. Okay. Is there a number code somewhere? Oh, I can use the screwdriver to open this thing, right? Yeah. Which is what I'm gonna do. This is a terrifying looking device. Is this an x-ray machine? Okay. <laughs> oh, I love it. Okay, maybe like that. Like that. That seems weird. Rotate you that way. Okay, that's looking pretty good. That is not looking good. Some of these are definitely out of place. For sure. I think you need to be... Yeah, okay. But hey, that wasn't so bad. I got that one going pretty quickly. There's a K on the x-ray machine for some reason. Don't know what that is there for. We got another one of these stars that we can adjust the, the height for. Do I put this thing in there? What? Is that candy? Wait, 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 wait. Can I take the... There's candy in there. I don't know why I x-rayed it. I could just open it. That'd probably simplify the whole process. Hello, this is the doctor's assistant. A. Got it. Next letter. X. Got it. I can see. Why are you giving me a vision test in a dentist office? <laughs> There's something fishy going on with this place. There is no G. There's no G, kid! Oh, it's hiding somewhere. There's a V. Where's the G, man? I see every other letter. Why is this G so hard to find? Okay, you know what? Here, take the scissors. They're all yours. Maybe the G is, is hiding? No. Oh, this person is, is changing. I don't, I feel like this is kind of a rude thing. Here, take your, you need your clothes. No, stop, I need to, okay, I got a Band-Aid. Is there anything in here? No? Okay. Seriously, where's that G? Maybe it's inside one of these boxes. That would be weird, right? I'm just, I'm x-raying all of these boxes, and I don't really know why. Soda? Okay. I don't, I don't see any Gs. Anybody need a Band-Aid? You need a Band-Aid? You? Band-Aid? You just want me to find the letter G. I will continue to hunt for the letter G. Do you need a band-aid? What do you do? What? I don't know what to do with that. What do you want? You want you want a piece of paper or something? Okay. Hey, there's, okay. I found something. Wait, are these items? These are actual items that I can place, huh? Yeah. Okay. So I don't need those for puzzles. I need them to win. What's going on with this? Ah, there's a G. Okay, let's go back to the kid. What else you got for me? E. I saw E. At some point, I definitely saw it. There it is. Boom. You got more for me? S. Have I seen an S? Yes, I have. Look at me knowing alphabets. You're done? Seriously? You, but you didn't give me anything, man. Oh, did it, did it spit out those glasses? It must have spit out those glasses. Those are for the doctor. He's gonna need those. What's going on over here? I got, I got like a, a towel of some sort. Maybe I can, I don't know. And then this thing. Oh, okay. Do I have to make the lines match maybe? Oh yeah, okay. You gotta make them more narrow. I you gotta bring them down a little bit. Oh, oh we were so close. There. Is that not it? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Whoo, all right. Let me just double check that a towel isn't on this. The, the pliers are on this. Hate that. What could that possibly be for? Maybe he has a splinter. What's going on with this thing? I put a towel on it? No. Oh, it's not a towel. It's a, it's a like a printer. <laughs> okay, the little girl wanted this. Here, take it. Thank you. You gave me a, a syringe. I hope that is some strong numbing medication. What's going on with this thing? Oh, 
you know what? I think, yeah, okay. Pink star goes in the middle. Green star goes to the top. And then there is no yellow star. I just win because I'm the best. What's left? Probably a lot. Is there, any, are you hiding anything in your coat? No, under your hat? No, all right, fair enough. What's this thing? Looks like a tissue box, maybe? Have we figured out what this is for? Three, two, seven, five, one. Oh, maybe it's the phone? How do you, how do you work this thing? Three, two, seven, five, one. Hey! Oops. I accidentally left the level. Give me this thing. What is this thing? I don't even know, but there you go, Doc. What about these lights? This kid's having the time of his life. Oh, he's thirsty. Or is that spit water? Whatever. Either way, he wants water. I need a cup. I see the water. Also, I still have no idea what to do with these boxes. Oh, I just took a hammer out of that one. Okay, maybe I can actually take items out of them if they're like usable items. Is there a cup in one of these? There is! <laughs> All right, there it is. Okay, uh, fill that up. There you go. Oh, gotta fill that up a little bit more. He said he wanted a full glass. There it is. All right. I spilt it! What? Seriously? Hold on. <laughs> He definitely wants a full cup. I gotta go, like, fast? Here. Okay. Ow. Too cold? Oh my gosh, this kid's so picky. So maybe do cold, and then warm, and then cold, and then warm. And then get it over to him fast. How's that? Ow. Still too cold? What's wrong with you? Do cold, and then warm, and then warm, and then warm. Maybe he wants it all? Maybe? <laughs> Nope, nailed it. All right, there you go. Thermometer, boom. Hammer, boom. What do you need that hammer for, dude? I don't want to know. And then the last item, a grenade. No, I don't know what that is. Oh, this. How do you open this? Stop laughing at me. All right, I had to use a hint. And it's telling me that it's this thing. Oh my gosh. They are tissues. I just had to pull the tissues out until I get a key, and then I open the emergency box, the medical box, and then in there is a grenade! That does look like a grenade. What is that? What, seriously, what are you doing with that, Doc? Seems, seems dangerous. Yay, we've got all the tools. Now I can rip out that tooth. <laughs> uh, well, looks like it worked. Don't know how long it took. Don't know how much pain that kid went through. The dentist did his job. My teeth hurt.